In just two weeks, a big Asian celebration is coming to the Jacksonville Landing. The city's Asian American Advisory Board holding an event aimed at celebrating Asian cultural diversity in Jacksonville. And joining us is Cheryl Noblea, and Maurice Haig, president of uh, Night of Asia. So we're so happy to have you both on the show today. Thank you. Thank you. And we saw a little practice earlier. We're going to show our viewers that later. But first, what's in store for people if they come in a couple weeks at this event? Well, um, we actually have um, Asian food as well as entertainment. And we have some Asian vendors that are going to be there as well. Why is this important for people to come out to, especially families who are not Asian? I mean, that's, that's a good cultural lesson for kids, I would think. Well, it's bringing visibility to the Asian community. Um, and as a board member for the Mayor's Asian American Advisory Board, um, we serve as a liaison to the 30,000 plus Asian Asians that represent over 20 countries in Northeast Florida. So working with Night of Asia, we both have the same mission. So it just made sense to try to work together to present the community to to the um, Jacksonville residents and your passion behind this sharing your culture talk about that yeah we I mean we recognize that Jacksonville we want to make it more culturally diverse and so you know we in the Asian community wanted to provide this free event um, to the city because Night of Asia has been around since 2012 and we usually have events that um, we have a lot of Asian dancing and food but we wanted to combine with the mayor's Asian advisory board just to give that opportunity for the whole city of Jacksonville to come to a free event to enjoy the Asian culture and spread that diversity. And some of that culture we have here on the table, these yes. beautiful garments. So talk about what what these are. We have the name, is that a Komora? Or? Yeah, this is Please a- fill me in. Please. Right, this is a, a, a traditional Chinese dress. Okay, it's stunning. Yes, and then we also have an Indian um, sari. Okay. And this is a Chinese fan. And yeah. this is um, what's called a, a malong. It's a Filipino, um, made um, blanket. It's actually a, a tunic, a tube okay. that they wrap around and for traditional folk dancing in the southern part of the Philippines. Oh, wow. And of course, See? we have Buddha. we are going to have a fashion show. <laughs> I didn't know at any of that. Event. Also, okay, to kind of display yes. this and teach people. That's wonderful. Yes. Absolutely. Now, food. Talk to me about food. <laughs> what are we going to have? There? Are, is there going to be some Thai food there? That's my personal favorite. Well, we have like a couple Asian food trunks and okay, cool. uh, trucks, and we also have um, an Indian you know, an Indian vendor doing yeah. Indian food. So what if you like called? curry, you know, yes. love Indian I food, do. we'll have that. And, you know, love of course, it. we'll have some Asian, you know, an Asian food truck as well. Right, that's, that's gonna so be there. wonderful. And, and some desserts. Ooh, too. gotta have dessert. <laughs> yes. All right, and you said it is free. Do people need to bring anything when they come? Or obviously it's cash for maybe the food trucks? Or? Right, yep. Okay. And, and we'll also have some Asian vendors as well. So right. we've got someone. So people can maybe buy some. Yeah, we'll have someone right. doing some, you know, Asian clothing, um, you know, some selling some, you know, wares and things like that, you know. So that'll be exciting as well. So we want everyone to come and enjoy that. Well, so the event is, I know the screen's going to say 5, but it's actually 4.30 because there's a band starting. We wanted to let you know. So 4.30 to 8 at the Jack. Jacksonville Landing. It's on June 23rd. There's going to be Asian food, vendors, entertainment, as well as some singers and dancers. And we're going to give you a little preview of something you're going to see down there at the landing.